Welcome back, everybody. This is Lady Dubs, and we're picking up right where we left off. Just about. Waiting for that loading screen to come along. Excuse me one moment. <coughs> okay, not me excuse. Oh, having made his way out of Amir's bruised psyche, Dan must now find the victim's wife, Helena. She's the one who called the body in Adam's apartment. She called the body in Adam's apartment. With the lockdown still in place, it's likely she's somewhere in the building. There were glimpses of a tattoo parlor in the dream eater. Seems like a good place to start. Alright. I think the... Yeah, it's right behind me. Alright, going to the tattoo parlor then. Hey, without further ado, no reason to drag this on. Knock, knock, who's there? Me! Uh. Oh, I get it, he's tattooing the... The non-real body parts, the, the prosthetics. That's what he's tattooing. Whoa. What's this? Oh, just another book of that. Ooh, wow. This uh, kid's getting slower, more and more a little messed up. And, uh, okay. Uh, knock, knock. Hello? Uh, why am I doing it? I could just go ahead and start scanning things. Scan this for me, please. Cash register. No match found. on register pre-road components. Yeah, it looks like a pretty old cash register. Are any of these things good? No. Can I scan anything else in this room besides the cash register? Oh yeah, I can scan this. Scan you. You are a Cassandra TO3. And you are a Grato DVR. Midway upon the journey of our life, I found myself within a forest dark, for the straightforward pathway had been lost. It is the seventh day of my forcefully imposed penance, and I can already attest without any doubt that this place is in fact hell. These people are dead, dead to the world. Their bodies still shuffle around their tiny apartments, but their minds are long gone. Huh, well that's pessimistic. Uh, personal computer. Oh, okay, we get some more reading, yay! The Forgotten Gallery, a collection of early 21st century body art. Okay. Uh, alright, I don't know much about tattoos, so, uh, I'm assuming that this is impressive? I'm sorry, I just... I don't know. I know this is impressive drawing, art, no doubt. I just don't know, like, if it's, like, uh, you know, written in, like, ink on, like, arms. Like, how much more impressive is it? I, I just don't know. I don't even have any tattoos as a reference. Okay, males. Six hats. Hey, man. Saw some of your work you've done on my friend, Dave. And I gotta tell you, that's some seriously wicked ink. I want to get in on some of that. I was thinking of doing an original design. Maybe a skull with flames around it. But get this. Flames are actually, like, animated and forming, like, a spider's web on my elbow. I know, pretty, pretty out there. But with your talent and my input, it ain't a no thing. So, like, draw me a line whenever you can squeeze me in. I'm good for money, too. I mean, I'm a bit short on cash, but you take nutrient stamps, right? Again, love your work, man. Dope ass ink. Let's pay me an exposure, buddy. Okay, special author. Hello. I hope I got the right address. If this is not, in fact, the Jack Ink Tattoo Parlor, please disregard this message. But if you are who I think you are, I was told by one of your former clients about your special line of tattoos. The high-end kind, if you catch my drift. My son would very much like to get one of those. In fact, he needs to get one done immediately. I know it's expensive, but I'm sure we can come to an agreement. Please contact me as soon as you read this. Alright, it sounds kind of like drugs, if I'm being honest. Uh, a reply to payment. I know you told me not to contact you again, and I have deleted all our messages history, just like you asked. I only wanted to thank you once again for the work you've done on my wife. The tattoo turned out to be a thing of beauty. She literally cannot imagine life without it. You're a real lifesaver. Rest assured. I'll have the rest of the money delivered by the end of the week. Okay, so maybe it's not drugs? Maybe it's some sort of illegal medical procedure? Okay, uh, documents. 
Hey, that looks like the head tattoo from uh, the dude that we saw dead. Well, almost at least. It looks like a Roman numeral. Uh, okay, weird skull head. Oh, those actually, that's kind of cool looking. Uh, that looks like kind of retro-futuristic. Ooh, it shines. And weird looking bunny heads, always good. And a skull, always gotta end it on a skull. And oh, we got the fire and sword and spiders. All right, let's take a look at this new world. Bloody spiders again, okay. So the wizard's like right in front of me. Uh, okay, let's run through and see what happens. Uh, okay, so I come to you and you want me, but I don't want you. So I'm gonna go ahead and run this way. And wow, I got a lot of spiders on me, don't I? Uh, okay, uh, I go down this way maybe. And you want my booty, but you're not gonna get my booty. And I'm gonna go, uh, this way. Oh, no, they get me. Okay, you know what, guys? I'll catch you in a bit. Alright, guys, I figured out this spider one. Okay, first you wanna lure this guy to follow you, okay? And then these guys are just gonna follow you no matter what. And when you get this point, that guy's gonna follow you too. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about that guy following you either. Now, you want this dude to follow you for sure. And then you wanna have this dude follow you, but not a big deal when he does. Now, you're gonna loop around and get that coin, right? You wanna avoid that spider up there in the corner. Then you wanna get that coin. You know what? You're gonna screw these spiders and go rescue the wizard. And that's how you do it. You're welcome, wizard. Oh, no, not play again. Uh, back to Vinny, please. Okay. And, ah, uh, man, don't have six. What is this guy? Who knows this guy before? He's like an armored spider. Well, no worries. And I think with that, we looked through everything. Okay. That was fun. Uh, anything more I can examine? You know what, let me just play this again, see if anything changes. Midway upon the journey of our life, I found myself within a forest dark. Nah, it doesn't sound like anything new. I'll see you guys in a bit. Kidoki, I just gave myself some drugs, in case you're wondering. And, oh! Hi! Oh, you're the wife. My timing is really off today. Poor Hannah. Lazarski, 65621 We have a third victim. Time of death, about an hour ago. Starting forensic analysis. Aw, yeah, poor girl. Well, let's see if we can't figure out her cause of death. Oh, wrong button, my bad. The victim's blood is mixed with ink. Elevated hormone levels. Oh, fuck. Don't tell me you. Uh, was she like on drugs or something? Tattoo machine. Uh, oh, you mean like she died because like they like injected her with like, ink or something? The killer used the tattoo machine as a murder weapon. Oh. That's not good. What is this? Oh, my bad. Wireless pedal, oh. That was probably connected to the tattoo machine. There's some more ink. Oh, that's messed up, dude. Hollow injector. Uh, I see something here. We got a match. So you call the dead man in Adam's apartment. Okay. The neural implants untouched. Aw, man, poor girl. Got a pretty gruesome way to go. Multiple puncture wounds, a few inches deep. Ah, I just feel so bad for her, man. What's this? What's this? Well, more blood. Uh, I guess, uh, can't scan this? Oh, yes, I can. Scratch marks on the floor. Looks like she was dragged back here. Oh, no, you poor girl. I mean, I feel bad for your husband, too, as well. Like, 
You really tried your best to get away. Oh, you poor, poor child. I don't know why I'm calling her child. She's probably older than me. Well, there's more of your blood. Can I find any sort of, uh... Well, there's your chip. Wait, did I scan what was this thing? That was... What is that? This. Oh, that's your compact implant, right. What's this? Power adapter. Uh, power adapter for what? Is that, like, for the ink thing? I think the tattoo artist was the one who did it. I don't know why he would have a motive. Oh, you were trying to get into this thing, it would seem. Uh, okay. See if we can't scan that. Just a keypad. Okay, before I examine that further, I think I saw something on the, one of these desks. Like, yeah, that thing. Consider the seed from which you sprang. You were not made to live like brutes, but to pursue virtue and knowledge. We are all, as humans, prone to justify our behavior. Do not admit our wrongdoings and insist that we are in the right. I'm sure the simpletons investigating my so-called crime thought themselves justified. They could not fathom that progress demands sacrifice. The trail goes cold. What the fuck did you think you'd find here? Well, the tattoo artist, I guess? Whoever he is. I can't help but feel- oh, what's- Oh wait, I know that logo! That's the logo to the Layers of Fear! Yeah! This game was made by the same company, after all. A little easter egg there for people like me who give a damn. Gonna interact with that for, at all? Oh, that's how you interact with it. <laughs> oh, I can move this whole thing over if I wanted to. Hold up. Is this like a door I can go to? Let me walk around. Well, I can move you. I feel like that might be something of note. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can't crack this thing. Uh, let's go ahead and hack you. Connection established, okay. Don't know that one. Don't know that one. We got a one. Okay. Something, something, one, something. Alright, before I go in ahead and just punch in every random number I know... What the? Oh, I thought I could see through that. Let's see if there's like any sort of clue just lying around here that could help me. Oh, jeez, I just noticed the blood spatter on this wall. Oh, wait, were you trying to spell something out? That might be a three. I mean, it's the best I can think of. Okay, so maybe you did. Let's assume that the first letter number is three. That you were trying to give me a no. Alright, if we got three, then... Oh, jeez, what would the other ones be? And I don't see any other numbers around here. Unless there's, like, a number on, like, these things? The Hollow Ejector 2000, no. Can't interact with these things at all. It doesn't look like a number, does it? No, it looks like letters. Was there a number to you, maybe? Uh... Pocket Indicator Tattoo Power Supply. Brawl. Nope. The size and shape of the needle are consistent with the puncture wound. Well, we now know for sure that this is the murder weapon. Well, I can't figure out what's missing in terms of the numbers, so I'm just gonna put in every random number I know. See you in a bit. Oh! Layers of ink! Ha! Huh, I get it! That's a good one, game. Wait, press the middle button to connect? Okay. Warning, 
Attempting a necroneural connection is in direct violation of the Postmortem Observation Act of 2061. Authorization denied. Emergency override. Open maintenance panel. right now. I, I can't even be scared by it. Because just based on how the last time was more annoying, if anything, like, not scary, like, I don't know, I just, I can't bring myself to be scared. Or just, I can't feel scared, because I just don't find it scary. I don't understand why the lights are flickering here, when there's nothing to see or do. Uh, okay, uh, to the next light, it would seem. Ugh, I'm stuck in something. This whole place is too dark. Ah, it's too dark. Maybe 
they gotta cut through around here and hug the wall? Just trying to get to the side. Yeah! Again. It's called soup. Now dig in. It's not getting any better. What? What? Um. Okay. Okay, screen snake, uh, black snake thing. If I can keep up with you, that is. Jeez, you are a fast little guy, ain't ya? Oh, wow, he's... No way I'm gonna be able to keep up with him like this. Ah, oh, crud. I already lost him. Oh, I'm gonna be stuck in this maze of cubicles forever. Yes, hello, yes, uh, hi. Uh, yeah, I am, I am, I'm trying to find, uh, a cable snake. Uh, you might have seen him come by here before. Uh, asked me to follow him for some reason, and, uh, because this is all just a weird fever dream, I feel obligated to follow I am completely trapped in this... Oh. Okay. Uh, so, oh, oh, when I move, you guys move. Oh, okay. I get it, I get it now. But the longer I'm here, the crazier people seem to get. Oh, hi! Um, can you help me, please? Oh, hi. Oh. Uh, can I turn you back on, please? Uh, I don't really quite like this. I guess it doesn't really matter what I like, huh? Oh, good. Let's go take a look at the weird blobby monster. Nope, it's gone. Great. <laughs> oh, God. Please don't turn this into, like, a hide-and-seek, it's gonna kill me kind of thing. something. And this guy died at 36, and he had webbed toes, too. Ah, oh, sucks to him. Being dead, that is. What the? Oh, that's not a button. Oh! Let's keep going. And we keep moving and grooving, I must say. Beats can't get sued with these beats while these people are the freaks. I know what's ahead is gonna suck. Oh look, I was right. Down we go. Ha. Um. Okay, we can't go back it seems. And this guy is making something. Or why is everything so? I don't know. In disarray. Things kind of messy. Where's my snake friend? My cable snake friend. Whoa, whoa! Through surveillance. Um. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm fine with surveillance, dude. I, I got nothing to hide. I can't really read that. Uh, hi. Oh, it's a little 
freaky. I guess because now we're connected to someone who's really dead, things are going to be a little harder. Patient card ready to print. Automatic printing set for 8.30, a.m. All right, so we can expect a print at 3.20. Is there a watch or a clock anywhere? Uh, hello? No? Okay. Oh, here's something we can interact with. Oh! There we go. Three. Twenty. Oh, you know what? We gotta make it... We gotta make it AM, first and foremost. And now we can make it 320. Alright! I'll take my treat out, please. Oh, another one of these things. Uh, okay. Left arm never found, and uh, recommended for further examination until he died at the age of 29. Let's examine them after their deaths. I so missed like a whole bunch of these, I just know it. Uh, okay, uh, hello? Don't lie to us, okay! Closing that. Uh, hello? Why is there laundry in here? And why is there even more laundry in here? Why is the laundry all bloody? Uh, I'm scared to look in here. Oh, that's not so bad. Well, also not so bad. Uh, it looks like it's a mirror of the floor in the floor. Uh, Amir, else? do you remember the night we met? Uh, maybe? Oh, it's the nightclub! Walk to this computer. Which is not. What? What? Hello? Hello? Hey, baby. I'm home. What? 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 Where are you? Oh, okay. Not, I'm not gonna open that. Screw that. Uh, babe? Hey, babe? Baby. Oh, thank you! 
Oh, thank you. My number is 896. Thank you. Wait your turn. Jeez. Uh, okay. Whoa. Hey there. That's a very pop. That's a very intro very intuitive work you got going on here with the self-cleaning mop. And here we are. My turn. But wait. I gotta use the bathroom. Nope. Never mind. I can't. Hi. Why is there a baby cry? Please tell me this is not an instance where she act- where she- Oh. Who are you? Why are you all twitchy? You alright? Is- is mom gonna be alright? She's sick, Adam. Must have a little faith. It's just hard to say. Oh, this is this is our mind that we're kind of messing up with. This was the day I guess Mama died, our wife died, mother to our child. Uh, it's a story. No, that order isn't even open. I'm not sure about this. Not sure. <laughs> Didn't you hear? This, this is great news. Let's take some more time to think about it. What is there to think about? You should be happy. Who says I'm not happy? What are we supposed to be happy about? And why are we looking into my psychosis? We're supposed to be looking into hers to figure out what the hell happened. I guess my wife got like that genophage plague thing that killed everybody. Or killed a whole lot of people. Oh! This is your chance. Yeah? Just just come on. I, I wanna follow you. Oh crud, it's too dark for me to follow you in here. Oh. Never mind. Now we're in the prosthetic department. Cool. Is that an apple? That is an apple. Oh, that is no longer an apple. That is... Oh, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? Yep. Alright, you can get up now. Just take it easy. It... is it... is it done? Congratulations. You are now the proud owner of a CT-72 internal data storage. I've given you an accelerant to make the tissue heal faster. Just keep that dressing on for the next couple of days. You, uh... Are you sure they won't find it? It's got a built-in scrambler and a shielded frame. No external scanning equipment can penetrate it. It's ghostware. Undetectable. Unless you know exactly where to look. Oh, this is what the girl got from the tattoo artist. Why did she want it, though? Maybe to, like... Because, like, Chiron was being a... Total jerks to her and her husband. She decided to do it so she won't be detected. Get a new life, maybe? Well, that's an idea. What's this? What Found is this? Oh. The hell did you do to yourself? Uh... Don't Nothing. even start! I did what I had to! It's about time someone around here showed some initiative! What's that supposed to mean? You don't know. Yeah, what she said. Uh, I can't get through around this way. Uh, okay. Uh, can't get through this way. Let's see. Oh, no, yes, I can. I can climb over it. Wow, this place is all upside down and wonky. Leave me the fuck alone. Hello? No, please. Tell me. Tell me again how useless I am. How I can't keep a job because no one will hire a fucking junkie ex con. Whoa. Amir. Do you even know what you're getting into? No. I really don't. Uh, hello, It's honey. not that they have a choice. We need the money, Amir. Whatever it takes. Huh? Okay, so whatever she did... Oh! Gross! What 
whatever it takes. Uh. Mark my words, that shit is gonna be the death of us. Okay, we're back at work now. Uh, download? Okay. Complete. Uh, oh great, now we gotta walk around here again, don't we? Question is, where the hell the hell do I get out of here? I guess that's a real philosophical thing, you know? You don't really get out of here in the corporation. You stay in here for life. Ah, uh, hi there, oddly placed chair. Not even conveniently placed. Okay! Yep, okay, oh, oh, what the hell? What the hell? Uh. Crud. I do not like these types of things at all, hide and seek. Running! Running, 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 Game over. What, you doing? Seriously? Huh. Okay, I actually do have to get past that guy. Ah, crud. I really suck at these kind of one-hit kill things. Okay, guys, I might have to BRB on this. Um. Uh. Okay, fine. boss. I hope we're out of the sequence soon. I don't like these sequences. They're not fun. They're just a whole bunch of nothing to, like, you want to have questions answered, but these things aren't giving me any answers. Just, they give me more confused, and not in, like, the give me more questions that make me wonder about the story kind of way. It's confused as in, like, why did I even need to be thinking about this in the first place? Uh, and, like, things I don't even have to think about. Like, dude, like, that monster, what is the point of it? Like, okay, so we got attacked by a monster, I think? Back at our house, I think? What is that monster? And what was with that blood goop? Like, j there's just more questions, and I'm not getting any answers for them. Also, how do I get out of here? That's another good question I think I need to ask. 
Let's take a look, I guess, of the glowing light. Good enough, I guess, say to look at this. No. Uh, what about? Oh, okay. Uh, confidential download. Oh crud! I'm gonna have to go to each and every one, won't I? And I'm gonna have to deal with the monster. Yep. Saw that coming. I don't even know where he is. Oh crud! He's right there. I'm dead. He saw me. Oh. Okay, I'm hiding. Okay, he went by. That's fine. I'm gonna go to the one over here. Just so I can give myself some distance. And I can't distinguish where he is based on his footprints. What pets? I don't know. Uh <laughs> Tell me he caught me enough times for it to give me like automatic bad ending. Okay, I'm gonna BRB. I do it? Is the monster gone? God, I hope so. I do not like these kind of monsters at all. Okay. Can I find an exit now? Oh, yes. That looks exity. Eh. Just run to it. Just run. Please take me out of here. Good. I don't care where you take me. I don't care if you take me to the Matrix or out of it. I just want to be out. Damn, did I learn anything about what happened to this woman? Like, at all? <sighs> I hope there's no more of that monster for the rest of the time I'm here. Oh, there's some eyes. Uh, oh, great. Okay. Oh, people feeding birds. How nice. Wait, what was up the stairs? I went down this way because it seemed like the least obvious way, but was going up the stairs even an option to start with? No, it was not. Wait, no. Yep, no, it was not. It had a lock. Okay. Into the darkness we go. Or the weird TV land, I suppose, is a better way to put it. Oh, I gotta keep ducking, huh? Alright, fair enough. Almost out, I hope. Hopefully no more monsters. Hello there, weird snake. That goes into the train. Nice. Uh, can we turn that off, please? Thank you. You don't waste water in this house. Oh god, please tell me that monster isn't back. Whoa, 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 okay. What is that thing? Okay. Can't leave. Can you like examine what was here? No? Okay. Uh, light is out. And things are getting wonky. It's. Where's this leak coming from? Jesus. Oh, okay. Is that a heart? Stuck in something. 
up, kid. You're on your own. Okay, I guess I'm on my own, kid. Uh-huh. I think I have to jump in there. Oh, wait, no. What? What the? Is there an outlet somewhere? Yeah. There we go. Can I leave now? Thank you. Uh, how much more of this am I going to have to deal with? This just does not seem relevant to the story. I think that was me. Yep, come on. No, no, no. I want you to come with me. Very good. Oh, look at all these tapes. Alright, plug you in. Oh boy. Alright, what's in here? Alright, I guess I can't hang out here for very long. Come on! Where'd you go? Ah, screw you, I don't need you. Uh, hello? Why am I hearing crying? Is this like, not, not the girl's mind, but my mind? I'm the one who has the kid. Oh, he just like doesn't answer, what the? Oh god, don't make me turn the faucet again. I'm just very lost and confused. It's not giving me any idea of which way to go. Just to, which way do I go? Follow the red light. You know what? Follow the red light. Yeah? That help? Hello? Okay, this is not helping me. What the? Oh, it just keeps on rebooting me! Uh, right through this door, it's so crazy. Oh, come on! I don't understand what you want from me, game! I, I can't think of any other direction to go into! What the? And now everything is just like, I can't even see! Oh my god, like if I was not recording this game, I honestly would just stop playing it because it's that kind of frustrating. Do I just like not do it when like loud noises are going out or something? I'll be right back guys when I figure out what this game wants from me. I'm actually about to just say screw it and I'm just like not gonna finish this game. I really don't like this. It's not giving me any sort of like on where to go. Yeah, again, this. What does this even mean? I'm just not gonna move. Okay. Okay. Doesn't make sense. Just let me in. The hell. And it just puts puts me back here. What the hell? I think 
think I might just stop playing this game altogether because this is just ridiculous. I'm going in every possible direction I can. And if I zoom in on something, it boots me back here to this beginning. Like, is there anything in here? Can I, I can't even interact with anything here. I'm gonna look up a walkthrough because this is just infuriating and not fun. Okay, so based on the walkthrough I saw, I need to find that computer thing again and use it as a flashlight? But I, I didn't bring it with me. If this is it. I think I just screwed myself because I didn't bring that little flashlight thing with me. I feel like a boot to an extra checkpoint. I don't want to have to go through that stupid monster thing again. It was a big pain in the ass. God, this game, this game just is bad. Like, I know, like, so many people, like, like, not so many people, like, like, it's just, come on, pull it out of the wall. Some people worked on this, and I'm sorry, but I'm not having fun, and it's like, the, I loved Layers of Fear, and this game is just not fun. I'm not having fun. Which is the whole point of a game, to have fun. And... You know what? I'm gonna give up on Observer. This is it. This is the last video. It, its story is not good enough to hook me in, and its gameplay is just not fun. I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna torture myself into playing this game. For literally nobody. So yes, yeah, this is the end of the video and this is the end of this Observer series. Goodbye.